and I'm not gonna even you know talk about how much money I saved by owning this machine because it's way cheaper than drying clothes in laundromat and I have one trick which I want to share with you guys hey everyone it's been almost a year since I got my portable dryer and I decided to sit here because I got comments that I should show the size of it so I should show myself right next to it so here I am sitting right next to my dryer in my bedroom so I often get questions about my dryer asking me you know if it still works if I still like it and if I still recommend it and as you can see it's still here I still use it and I use it like usually two times a week uh, sometimes more often if I do laundry more often but usually it's like on Wednesday and on Sundays and since I got it I didn't have any issues with this machine uh, I make sure to clean the filters regularly uh, there's one filter on this side right here but there's one filter here which we should you know also um, clean regularly and replace from time to time and there's one filter inside right there I usually try to clean it two times a week sometimes I forget and I just do it once a week and I think it's very important to make sure your dryer filter is lint free because uh, if you're gonna let it build up for you know over a month or even longer it may cause your machine to have issues it will overheat and it may break so that's definitely something you know you can't just forget and I know that one person left a comment under my previous video where I was reviewing this machine um, and they said that the machine broke and they did not clean the filter um, you have to clean the lint filter even with the regular dryer it's very important uh, I used to do it after every load so here is the air take filter which I don't really clean that often uh, to be honest, I only replaced it once after like maybe eight, nine months of using the uh, the machine. So yeah, I mean, it doesn't look super clean, but it's good for now. Um, the lint filter, which uh, you're supposed to replace like, mm, you know, basically at least once a week, um, is over here, you can see. So this is how it looks. That's the one I um, replaced. This one is, you know, this one is from Amazon. Uh, and yeah, this is how it looks. So basically you take this off and what I usually do, I just vacuum this part. Um, and then you have to open this part and you can see I already cleaned this part, but there'll be a lot, a lot of lint on this part and you just have to take it off. And I put this together and then I just put it back in. Done. With this machine it may feel like it's a little bit more work cleaning the lint filter, but to be honest, after you know a few months of owning this machine, it doesn't feel like it's that much more work. And I can definitely tell that machine works better when you know the filter is clean. So that's something I really wanted to mention because I know that um, you know some people experience the issue with the machine when they did not clean the lint filter. So uh, yeah, this machine is great at taking lint out of your clothes. Um, if I have, you know, dirty clothes, like, I have, you know, I have a dog and he sheds a lot. And sometimes I'm just going to put clothes that are dry but are full of lint just to get rid of the lint. Uh, and it works great. And I love it. That's, you know, it, it works. And, you know, uh, since I started using it, like, my clothes are so much softer. It's just, it's very nice, you know, to um, dry my clothes in a dryer instead of just you know uh, on a rack uh, so yes I have no regrets I bought this machine for like around three hundred dollars plus tax so it wasn't cheap uh, but it's so worth it even though it's taking up space in my bedroom as you can see you know uh, I do care about aesthetics in my bedroom but that's something I'm willing to sacrifice just to have the comfort of owning a dryer and being able to dry my clothes you know within an hour within two hours uh and you know having this feeling of you know super soft fabric uh so yeah i mean it, you know of course there are pros and cons of owning a dryer but i do believe that this dryer is a very good quality dryer i have not experienced any issues with it period um 
since it's been a year I actually replaced the uh, original lint filter and also the uh, air take filter I bought um, just a couple of uh, filters on Amazon I'm gonna link um, those filters down below they were like under $20 and I think I got like 10 or 15 filters so like it will last for a long time um i'm just gonna replace it whenever i'm gonna damage the other uh filter but uh yeah i so far it's been almost a year and i only replaced the filters once so i think that's pretty good and i'm not gonna even you know talk about how much money i saved by owning this machine because it's way cheaper than drying clothes in laundromat i definitely did my calculations i have a budget and i can see uh, how much money we are saving on having in unit washer and dryer it was definitely worth it i'm super happy with it uh you know i wish i had separate room where i can store my dryer and washer but it's okay i don't have space for that but i still love it and i would still like if if you would ask me like if i would repurchase my dryer i would say yes definitely um but so far it's working great i use it very often and i use the highest heat settings uh, pretty often too and i have one trick which i want to share with you guys and that's something actually one of you recommended in the comments uh to dry clothes um faster uh just put a dry towel with your clothes and to be honest it does work uh, i can definitely tell this is a pretty big you know just whatever towel which i never use um and i just it's always in my dryer and whenever i have you know wet clothes which i want to dry i put everything with this towel plus you know dryer sheets uh which are these are my favorite i love these ones just the smell is insane like it's so good um uh, so these ones I can recommend and they last forever. I bought this months ago and I still have plenty of dryer sheets. Uh, but um, yeah, that's a great trick um, because obviously, you know, it cuts uh, the drying time. It cuts, you know, the cost of drying because obviously you don't dry your clothes for too long. Um, and I think it's also better for, for your clothes, for fabrics, because, you, you know, you don't have to dry uh, your clothes in the dryer for longer than they need to be. Um, so yeah that's a great tip thank you guys for sharing uh, now I'm sharing in this video uh, so yeah I think that's it all I wanted to mention um, if you have any questions let me know in the comments and I will see you soon in the next video bye bye